I've never been afraid of the future. I always used to look to next year and smile because it meant that us kids could do more things. It meant that we could have later bedtimes and watch scarier movies. We used to relish in the fact that we wouldn't be treated like little kids anymore. We wouldn't have to ask for permission to watch Jimmy Neutron on Saturday mornings or even eat mac and cheese for every meal. Back then, our responsibilities were almost non-existent. We didn't have to worry about breaking the bed when we were jumping on it. We didn't have to worry about the destruction left in the wake of our pillow forts. We didn't have to worry about losing our oldest friends when they disappear halfway across the country chasing the college of their dreams. We didn't used to have responsibilities. And now, we have too many. Now most of us are trying to complete what feels like thousands of assignments working through the dead of night, desperately trying to keep up with the onslaught of work. In the place of pillow forts, we have mountains of papers and valleys of pencils. People always say, teenagers have nothing to worry about. They should just suck it up. Well, you try being handed the responsibility of finding a college, applying, waiting in sheer terror of potential rejection, and when you are accepted, finding a way to pay for it. You try writing scholarship essays on top of the homework and projects from at least seven classes and then being expected to maintain a job and take part in extracurricular activities. You try to accept the fact that Despite your best efforts, your childhood is slipping through your fingers like sand, and no matter how hard you try, you can never get it back. I've said before that I've never been afraid of the future. And that's true, but now I am. I'm afraid of losing people that I've known for a decade. I'm afraid of saying goodbye to a place where up until now my whole world has taken place. I think the reason that I'm afraid of the future is because it's blank. Every move, every action, every single thing I do now paints the blank canvas that is the future and whether or not that future is bright sits on the tip of a double-edged brush. And that's why, before I pick up that double-edged brush, I should say thank you. Thank you to every person who's ever made me smile or laugh. Thank you for allowing me to have a childhood that's so hard to say goodbye to. The future, ultimately, is what we make of it. And if we can become people that we can truly be proud of, then allowing our childhood to fall away in the wake of great people is what truly matters. <laughs>